you work with your actors on your show? How much, for example, for and Kimmy Schmidt, mm -hmm. who seems to be perfectly embodied by Ellie Kemper, it's as if she were born to play this right. character. Yeah. How much input did she have in the creation of? Well, yeah, we, we, we reverse engineered it from her. Really, mm -hmm. uh, you know, her name was floated to us as someone to develop for, and it was the first name that kind of popped for us. I mean, that happens a lot when you're between things. People are <laughs> pushing names, and we met with her and. And she just confirmed our sense of who we thought she was on screen. <laughs> um, and that's a rare thing to be able to communicate, I think, and, and to have any intelligence behind it. And she has a lot. As showrunners, we're producers. We, we have to interact with, with everything. And that have to is the wrong way to put it. It's great to be able to put your finger in every pie, even the ones you don't deserve to have any opinion about. Uh, so we work very closely with our actors. And, and uh, Ellie was on board immediately, and she's, she's just game. Um, but, uh, you know, we're always, or, or some close representative of us is always on the floor. Someone who knows the script and knows our intention. And their job is to make sure the, the directors and the actors understand what we're trying to say, and often that's us. So what do you want to do tonight? Honestly, listen to Diana Ross albums alone while I do my stretches to alleviate my gas. We should go out to celebrate. I mean, I got a job today. I got an apartment. I met you. I envy you. I've never been able to meet me. Come on. We should go dancing someplace cool like Club Bombay from Moesha. Whew. Things are behind in Indiana. I mean, I've been very right. lucky, even in my network time, of having pretty thoughtful and, and, you know, not the stereotypical executives. But even a bad note or a note that's poorly articulated or that you don't understand, Tina and I always try to step back and treat that like a, an audience member. I say, what are they trying to say? Mm -hmm. And yeah, there are, I, I could think of some... If I had a little longer, I'd think of some <laughs> ridiculous notes we've gotten, but it's still, there's something that they're reacting to. And I would miss it, I think, mm -hmm. on some level, if that weren't there. And as, it, as we're in Netflix now, it's something we think about and talk about, because like, it is a different uh, back and forth with them than it is with Do you the, guys get notes to them? It's been so minimal. And again, we were in an unusual situation where we had edited half the, the season for NBC. Do they say things like, I think it would stream better? <laughs> 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 it's been very hands-off and very sort of big-picture, thoughtful kind of stuff. Uh, and so I feel, okay, do we need to now play that role of being... Yeah. Well, you always have to be your, your own worst critic. something that you did that was daring or crazy to land a writing job that you really wanted? The interviews you have with writers are mainly, from my experience, to make sure they're not crazy. Yeah. <laughs> and it is kind of amazing how people can blow it yeah. and reveal that they're crazy. Yeah. Um, as managers, it's a really hard yeah. thing because I think we're paid to be empathetic and, and we put ourselves in, in those people's shoes. They have the same dream that we have. And I always feel like, oh, if I say the wrong thing, I take someone aside and hey, do you feel like you're being heard? And we'd love to hear from you more. You were so funny in the interview, and you're kind of talking in a code because I'm afraid to just say, do you think it's working? Do you think your voice is fitting this? Do you think you're mm -hmm. How many gelling? times has that conversation actually worked? Have you actually took someone inside and said, I need you to be better, and they actually got better? I feel like I'm better. <laughs> I feel like I so you heard what I was saying? Because I, 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 I was like being very coded. <laughs>